Kapalua, Hawaii, the plantation course for the final round of the Century Tournament of Champions. Jordan Speed eight under, working from off the green at the seventh. And this is a nice play. That one finds the bottom of the cup from 41 feet to get to nine under par. Dustin Johnson in control of the leaderboard and in control of his driver. Take a look at this. A par four, plays 420 yards, hopping off the left side. And Dustin Johnson watches as this one works all the way to the back flag. Could it be? Oh, he was that close to a double eagle. A tap in two for DJ on to 14. An eagle try here. This is the more conventional route for an eagle. Just inches short, though, as the conditions started to worsen, a little rain, a little wind. John Rahm, third shot at the par 5 15th from about 65 feet. That one passes by on the left side. He would make the birdie to get to 15 under. Dustin Johnson also at 15. Nice controlled shot. That left for a birdie to get to 23 under par. Brian Harmon, winner of the Wells Fargo Championship last season. That's how he made it into this winner's only field. Nice shot there coming back. And he would make the birdie to get to 15 under. Ricky Fowler finishing up at 18, 50 yard play. This one working to the back flag. Settles about four feet in front of the cup and he would make the birdie to get to 14 under par. No one was catching Dustin Johnson though. 23 under working with a large lead and his second at 16, just a short shot in, he would make the birdie. Rom at 17, 10 footer. That takes him to 16 under par. He would finish solo second, but Dustin Johnson, the day belonged to him as he would put together an eight under round on his way to a 24 under total, his 17th win on the PGA Tour, second here at Kapalua. A look at the final leaderboard, a two shot win for DJ 16 under, thanks to his 66 here in Kapalua. It's on to the Sony Open in Hawaii over on Honolulu. Look forward to the coverage Thursday.